Hey guys, how's it going? Today I am coming at you with another giant sticker haul and this time it is going to be filmed in two parts and the reason why it's going to be filmed in two parts is because your girl is crazy and spent a hell of a amount of money in the month of April on stickers and so yes, this is going to be the first part with the first part of my stackery order I am currently waiting on a few other things to arrive in my stackery warehouse in America so that I can get the second half of the haul shipped over. So it'll probably be a few weeks before I get that. So that's why I'm filming the first part now because I seriously could not wait. And so, yes. This is what we have in front of us and not gonna lie, this part of the haul is mainly going to be Glam Planner because at the start of April she had a huge seal and I just went crazy. I was like, oh my god, it's a seal. I have to get lots of stuff because it's on seal. And so yeah, basically for April, self-control went out the window because actually the reason why I did do a lot of shopping recently is because a lot of shops are doing seals. So yeah. Anyway, uh, let's just jump into this. I'm so excited. I don't even know where to begin. Um, I think we'll leave Glam Planner till the last and we'll do every other shop first. So let's uh, clear up this space a little bit and get into this haul. All right, so the first shop that I wanna start off with really quickly is this one. It is a random one that I ordered from on Etsy and they are called Polis Police. Is that how you say it? Polis Police. Not really sure, but this is what the little um, thank you card looks like. And then I also got a little freebie from them. And then also I got some Plum Bob stickers because the shop that I used to order from for my Sim stickers uh, shut down. So I really needed some Plum Bob stickers. So I got these and uh, they also have this cute little sticky note on them. And it says, I hope you can give these imperfect stickers a home from Siobhan, so that's really cute. I don't think they're imperfect, I think they're, oh. Oh, okay, sorry. I was a little confused. So these are the ones I ordered, which are cut and they're perfect, and this person gave me a freebie, which is um, a little bit of imperfect ones, and the cut lines are a little bit off on some of the plum bobs. That's what I'm just realizing. That's what this little sticky note is for. So this is um, some imperfect ones that they sent me, but like, honestly, it's not a big deal, like, you know, you can still, you know, the plum bobs are still there, they're just not in line with the sticker, there's a little bit of white space around them, but like, that's no big deal, of course, sis, of course I'm gonna love them, that's great, so, got some plum bob stickers. Next, I have these two orders from Once More With Love, and the reason why there's two orders is because I was worried that I wasn't going to get the washi card in my first order, because here's the deal. So, Once More With Love was doing this freebie giveaway. If you put washi card in the comments of your order, she would send you a free washi card. But the thing is with Shopify shops, is that if you put a note in your order, uh, you don't see that in your order confirmation or anything. There's nowhere to say that you added the note to your order. So I was over here after I'd made my order. I was kind of freaking out and I was like, oh my gosh, what if like I didn't put the washi card in the comments? Like what if she didn't see it? Um, so I panicked and I ordered another couple of sheets of stickers to make sure that I got my washi card. But turns out I didn't need to panic at all because I actually got sent two washi cards. So yeah. That was a little bit of panic on my part, but nonetheless, here we are. So we're gonna get into these. All right, so I'm just gonna go through my big order first. So first of all, this is the washi card, which looks stunning. It's a Disney theme, it says magical on it. I am obsessed with it, and I'm really glad that I got one. Well, I'm really glad I got two, but I would've just been happy with the one. So this is the washi card. And then I bought all of this stuff on seal because Once More With Love did a little uh, Michael's Stickers Plan With Me event and after the event she said that she was doing a seal on her shop. She said that 
if you went on her shop and used the code Michaels, you would get a discount. And I jumped all over that because Once More With Love doesn't do any PR codes or anything like that. So anytime that there's a seal, I'm gonna jump on it. So here we go. So first of all, we have this really cute April freebie. And these are really cute. They got the little dinosaur, the little like painter, Bob Ross. We have a little fragile munchkin in the box. Oh my goodness. I relate. We have a little duck. <laughs> and because of that autocorrect, I love that. And then, you know, you have your little like location pointer. So these are super cute. I love the freebies from Once More With Love. And then we just have a bunch of stickers. And honestly, I don't know what it was when I was shopping on the sale, but part of me just like was going through every page on Once More With Love and I just immediately found like all these munchkins that I suddenly needed, even though I've never needed them before when I've shopped with Once More With Love, but this time they were just speaking to me <laughs> and so that's what we ended up with. So we'll go with this column first. So we have these busy workday munchkins, which isn't me all the time, but also sometimes I relate. So we got those. We have some little stretching munchkins because I do a lot of stretching. We have these generally unwell munchkins, which are super cute. And then uh, that's it for that pile. It was kind of short, okay. Uh, so moving on to the second pile, we have these best friend slash sisters stickers, which I'm super excited to be able to use when I can go out and see my friends again in real life, because that'll be super fun. We'll literally look like these two munchkins here. We'll be like super happy and super like love and life. So that's really cute. And then I got some little cleaning munchkins because, uh, we have to clean the house sometimes as an adult. Uh, I have these stickers, which literally describe me in this haul video. This sheet of stickers is basically me. Uh, I need it. I have to buy them. Oops, I bought too much. Definitely me. But yeah, I just thought those were very fitting and I had to get some of those. And then I also got these cute movie and TV couple watching munchkins, which I will use all the time because me and my boyfriend love to watch movies and TV. And then we're back to the beginning. So that was my first order from Once More With Love. And then it came with this really cute journaling card, which says, as long as you live, keep learning how to live. So... That's super cute. I really like that. And then uh, moving on to my second Once More With Love order. So again, this is the washi card, which is super cute. And then we have again the April freebie. And then also these two sticker sheets. So again, I got another one of these ones, which is the bye 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 shopping spree one. Because honestly, like I said, I panic bought these so I definitely needed more of these and then I also got the little sneaky shopping spree ones because this is also me a lot when I buy stickers so yeah very fitting and then again we have the journaling card so that is everything that I got from Once More With Love now we are moving on to Wonton in a Million like I said in my last video I'm totally obsessed with these guys so I will probably always have an order from them in a haul video just because I can't help it. So this is the little card that comes with my order and inside we have all of our stickers and we also have another little info card up at the Steam Team which is on the menu and it's super cute. The last time I got the Lunar New Year one, I guess this is just like the generic one that comes with uh, the orders. You know, this is kind of like an anytime sort of situation. So there's that. So first off, we have a little freebie and it says, in case you missed them, emoji stickers, which is super cute. Of course, I missed the emoji stickers because I feel like I didn't buy any. So yeah, there's this like heart one, the monkey one, the little fighting one, and a little sad heartbroken one, which is cute. So that's my little freebie. Next. We have my order. So first of all, we have these little Galentine ones. Just girls hanging out, living their best lives. And again, I bought these for when I could finally see my friends again and hang out with them because, 
you know, things are starting to open up again in the UK, so I'm really excited to see my friends and spend some time with them and use these stickers to mark the occasion. And then we have two pages of the Sticker Addict because, again, I feel like this very accurately represents me at this time of my life. So I got two sheets of these. And then I got these little birthday wontons, which are super cute because I feel like I don't really have stickers to mark birthdays. So I got these, so they're super cute. And then I got some yoga ones because I don't use these for yoga, but I will definitely mark my stretches with these and I thought they were cute, so I got some of those. We have some nail wontons because I've been painting my nails for these videos, so I wanted something to mark that. Uh, I got more walk stickers because, you know, we still take them walks. And I also got these ones. These are the running out of steamy ones. And honestly, as soon as I saw them, I was like, oh my gosh, I have to get those. So those are super cute. And then we are back to the beginning. So that is everything from Wonton in a Million. All right, so next we have Scribble Prints Co. And I did actually go a little bit overboard when I was buying from her. So first of all, I have this Christmas kit, which was on sale, so I decided to get it. And then I also did a big foil order because I, I mean, I did definitely go overboard with the foil, I think, when I was ordering because I also have a lot of foil from Glam Planner this time. And I'm really surprised about this about myself because I thought I was going to be good and stay away from all the foil. But now that I've started, I don't think I can stop. So that is my second order from Scribble Prints Co. But first, I think we'll get into the kit. Okay, so this is the Joy kit. I think I got the ultimate version of the kit. So these are the boxes. It also comes with these two alternative boxes, which are cute. So I'm just going to quickly flip through so you guys can see. So there's even more alternative boxes here as well. And then you have your deco, your heart checklists, and uh, habit trackers and stuff. I guess this is an old format of kit because I feel like it came out a while ago. Uh, we have our deco boxes and our fancy labels and icons. And then you get your plain labels as well and the bottom washi so that is the kit that i got from scribble prints co and then along with that i also got the glitter headers to go with that kit and then i also got another label box add-on for my daphne kit which i hauled in my last video and the reason being is because when i was ordering i kind of had this panic that i was going to run out of boxes for that kit because it's a mini and it doesn't come with as many boxes as the ultimate and I haven't even used the Daphne kit yet, but I do plan to really soon. So that's why I was like, I need to get another label add-on just in case. And so, yeah, that is my first order from Scribble Prints Co. Oh, um, also, these are some freebies that I got as well. So we have some silver foil here, which uh, just is a script sampler. And then we have this hollow summer like freebie, which is super cute. So that is what I got in my first order. So moving on to the foil. So like I said, I wasn't really planning to go overboard with a foil on Scribble Prints Co. But then I ended up getting a few foil bundles and that did end up equaling over $75. So yeah, you could definitely say I went overboard on the foil, but no regrets. So first of all, again with the freebies, so we have this freebie, which again is the um, Rainbow Hollow uh, Summer freebie, which is cute. And then we have the silver scripts again in the foil. And then there's also this gold script freebie as well. So then moving on to the foil bundles. So I got five uh, foil bundles. Let me look at my order sheet real quick to see which ones I got. So I got one in the gold snowflake bundle, two in the celestial champion lights, and then two in the silver confetti uh, foil bundle. So that's what I got. So we have the gold, the champion lights, and the silver. 
So first of all, I got this gold one in the snowflakes and I'm going to be using that with this uh, Christmas kit because, you know, I thought they would go well together. So let's look at this real quick. Okay, so we have the snowflake deco. We have these uh, full box overlays. We have some gold icons. We have some full box overlays and also some fancy header covers. Uh, we have three sheets of those. Oh, nope, it keeps going. We have a lot of those. <laughs> oh my goodness, there's so many of those. Okay, then we have more icons. And then we have the gold scripts as well. And then we have the bottom deco washi. And so that is everything in the gold snowflake bundle. Like I said, I'm going to be using that with my Christmas kit and I'm super excited about it. Next, moving on, we have the celestial bundle in champagne lights and the confetti bundle in silver. And because I got two of both of these, I'm only gonna open one of each because you don't wanna see all the repetitiveness. So first of all, we'll open the champagne lights one. So I got these champagne lights ones to use with the two kits that I got from Glam Planner the last time. So the Spooky Soiree kit and the Celestial Celebration kit. I thought that these would look really nice with that. And yeah, the champagne lights is gorgeous. I don't know if you guys can see, but it's got like that rainbow glitter effect when the light hits it. Oh, it's so stunning. So this is what you get in these kits. You have the box overlays. You have the header covers that's what they are glitter header covers and you get two pages of those and then you get your bougie boxes which I don't actually use in spreads but I'm definitely tempted to after watching all of Scribble Print Co's plan with me's because I think that would be fun but also the beginning of another problem with the sticker buying so we have the bougie boxes and then we have the icons and the scripts, which all look stunning. And then you have your date dots and your washi and the deco and stuff like that. And so, yes, that is a champion lights. And like I said, I'm super excited to be using that. Next, we have the silver confetti, and I'm going to be using this with the Daphne mini kit as well as uh, another kit that I have, I don't remember which one, but it's silver foil and it kind of goes with anything, so I will be using that as well. So again, we have your full box overlays and your fancy glitter header covers, and then you have your bougie boxes. I feel like this light is not really good for showing off the foil because I'm just using natural light, but like you guys get it. You know what the foil looks like. So we have the bougie boxes. And then again, we have our icons and our scripts, which look so fabulous. And then the bow washi and the date covers and everything. Ooh, there you go. That's it, the foil. Yeah, we love it, okay. Um, and so yeah, that is all I got from Scribble Prints Co. All right, so moving on to the main event. This is my Glam Planner order. Like I said, Glam Planner was having a sale at the start of April and I kind of went a little bit crazy, but I'm also not gonna apologize because I'm obsessed. And then along with the seal items, I did also get her spring mystery kit because I just thought like, why not? Let's just have a little fun. Let's see what we get. I'm not usually one to sign up for people's monthly subscriptions or anything like that, mainly because I don't use weekly kits all the time and I'm very picky about the weekly kits that I get. So I don't really do subscriptions, but I thought that doing like one mystery kit would be kind of fun. So I'm going to leave that to the end. We're going to just take it away, pretend we don't see it. Uh, because I don't want people to get spoilers if they haven't seen it already or if they're waiting for theirs in the meal. Although, honestly, I feel like everyone's already gotten there, so it's fine to show. But anyway, uh, yeah, we're going to start with all the seal items first because we got a lot. Uh, not as much as I thought I was going to get because she did have a lot of like glitch weekly kits and everything. And I definitely spent a lot of time looking on the website, looking at all the kits and stuff, but I didn't actually get any weekly kits. We got some foil oops. We got some scripts. We got a label grab bag, got three glitch monthlies, and then I got just a couple of other things as well. So yeah, 
this is a big order and I'm excited. So I think we'll go over the stuff that I got normally anyway. So let's open this. So in here, I just have some Happy Meal script samplers in the black because I got a lot of Happy Meal recently, so I just wanted to get some stickers to mark the occasion. And then along with that, I got some label add-ons for the Spooky Soiree kit, as well as the Celestial Celebration kit. Like I said, I hauled those in my last haul video. And again, I just had this random panic that I was going to run out of boxes when I was doing my spread. So I got two extra label add-ons for each kit, which honestly, I don't know if I'll need, but they're there you go, you can never have too many uh, label add-ons. So yeah, even if I don't use them with the kits I bought them for, I'm sure I could find a place for them somewhere. So I got those. Then moving on, I guess while we're talking about labels, I'll just go ahead and do like my label grab bag. So yeah, like I said, I was having this whole panic when I was buying stickers that I was gonna run out of boxes for kits that I bought. So I thought I'd just get a little bit of a label sampler so that um, in the future, if I get any kits and I run out of boxes, then surely I'll have some extra boxes to use for them. And I'm not really sure how many is in here, but it feels like a lot, like it feels chunky. But I'm just gonna quickly flip through to show you guys the different uh, colors that I got in this grab bag. Not that it's very interesting, but I'm gonna do it anyway. All right, so that was all of the label add-ons. There's quite a good variety of colors in here. And like I said, I just picked these up so that if any case in the future where I'm using a weekly kit and I do run out of boxes, that surely I'll be able to find some in this bundle. All right, and then moving on to the glitch monthly kits that I got. So this year I've decided that I was going to do monthly spreads in my Erin Condren. I never did the monthly spreads before so this is the first month that I'm doing it. So I decided to pick up some of these while they were on sale so that I could have some for the summer months. So let's go ahead and open these. So the first one here we have is an August one. I don't know if it's 2020 or 2019, but it did come with the foil. So you have the foil months and then you have this other quote, which says drink the wild air and it is just a really nice silver. So this is the monthly. This is what you get. I've never gotten a uh, Glam Planner monthlies before. So uh, this is new for me too. So we have your day covers and then you have the same on this side. You have a lot of icons at the bottom. You have your labels and things like that and your date covers as well. And then you also have your Ooh, your side deco and like your extra box covers, which are really nice. This is a really nice theme. I really enjoy it. And then you have your sidebar options as well. And so that is the August monthly. Next, we have a July monthly. And I'm really glad it doesn't have the year on this so that I can use it this year because it's really pretty and mermaid themed. So then you have your deco boxes and like your bottom washi and your icons. You have your date covers and also you have some more like deco boxes and then you also have your sidebar which I did notice down here it does have this which says August 2019 but I think what I'm going to do is either cut that bit off or just cover it with a sticker just so that I can use it for 2021. Uh, so it's not a big deal that there's a date on it. It's kind of annoying that it does take up this whole bottom area. But like I said, I can just cut it off or cover it with a sticker or do something else and make it work. And finally, moving on to our last monthly. This one didn't come with any foil. It doesn't come with a month on it or anything. So I'm not really sure what month this is supposed to be. But I'm going to definitely buy a sticker for it so that I know what month it is. So again, I wanted to use this for the summer months. I thought it'd be super cute. So it's got this like honeybee theme. 
and so then you have your deco and your icons and then your boxes and your date covers and then once again you do have your different sidebars so you can have the deco or you can have the check boxes and the date on this says may 2020 and again uh this is 2021 so i'm definitely gonna have to put a sticker over this or cover it in some way but yeah this is super cute and i'm really excited to use it i think i might actually use it for may this year and like i said i'm just gonna get a month sticker that says may and then it'll work perfectly in my erin condren so those were my glitch monthlies Next, we're going to move on to the foil, which I'm super excited about. So first of all, we have some foil scripts. So we're going to look at this. Not going to lie, but normally when I buy scripts, I do try to buy them in black because I don't always use foil in my planner. So I do prefer to get black because that can work with any time. But this was a grab bag and I couldn't really resist because I was already doing a lot of shopping. So yeah, so this is just a bunch of assorted scripts and you get a lot in this grab bag. Honestly, really impressed. So first of all, we have some grocery shop ones in gold foil. We have laundry stickers in rose gold. I'm trying my best to like show you guys the foil in this lighting, but I don't know if it's coming off great, but we'll just see. We have these bill budget ones in the silver foil. We have Neil hair appointment ones in sparkly hollow. We have plan stickers in the gold foil. We have print and cut in the rainbow foil. We have class ones in black, which um, I don't need because I'm not in class anymore. So we'll probably de-stash those. I have these cleaning ones in the gold, the date night ones in the rose gold, coffee time ones in silver, half day day off ones in black, with the family in silver, sleep late in the silver as well. We have some snuggle and bath time ones in black. We have target run in the rose gold. We do not have target in the UK, so probably gonna de-stash those. We have the late ones in gold and we're back to the beginning. So that is a lot of foil scripts in a grab bag. So I'm really happy with this. Don't remember how much I paid for it, but I still think it's a good value. Like that's a lot of scripts and you know, I'll use like 99% of them. So no regrets. It's fabulous. We love that. Okay. Uh, so those were the foil scripts. Last but not least, we have this Oops foil bundle, I believe. And like you can see, it has an assorted amount of objects in here. So let's get into it. All right, so this is gonna be a lot. Bear with me while we get through this. So first of all, we have some sparkly hollow planets, which honestly, I'm obsessed with. Like moving this back and forth is so satisfying. Oh my goodness. Distracted by this all day. It's amazing. So we got that. Then we have some date dots. We have them in rose gold and silver and also some sparkly red foil, which is cute. This could be good for my Christmas spread. And then we have some more scripts. So we have plan ones in the hollow foil. We have the cleaning ones again in the sparkly hollow. We have day at night ones in the rose gold. We have coffee time ones in the rose gold. We have day off ones in the silver. We have the sleep late ones in the silver. We have gold work ones. We have snuggle time ones in the gold. We have with the family in black. We have the target ones in the black. And so yeah. Even more foil scripts, that's amazing. I love that some of them match the other ones that I got, so like I can mix and match foils, so that's cute. And then we have some other ones. So this is a foil kit sampler in the rose gold. And then we also got one in the silver. And then we have some other like foil scripts. So this one says remember and it is in the rose gold. We have some reading ones in the gold. I feel like the foil isn't showing up as well in these ones, but you guys get it. Uh, workout in silver foil. Don't forget in rainbow foil. And then we have uh, some labels in silver. 
We have some faux box overlays in the rose gold. We also have some in the gold. We have some dia covers in rose gold. We have some more full box overlays in the silver. We have, what are these? I think these are bougie boxes because I'm trying to like make out the cut lines, but I think they're like four bougie boxes. So we have those in the gold confetti. We have those in the silver hollow. We have those in the silver. Oh wait, these ones are headers. These ones are headers. It's really hard to tell because of the foil, but the cut lines are there, so these are headers. And so that is that. Then, oh my goodness, there's so much in this foil bundle. So then we have these, uh, I guess this is like washi cover. So this was from the November 2020 subscription. So that's silver foil. Then we have some nondescript uh, hollow hollow yep silver hollow then we have this oh my goodness again washi strips but like rainbow hollow love that then we have some glitter hollow washi which will cover your headers and such oh those are like half cut headers and then we have like some regular washi we have some more bottom washi with the silver we have some gold washi we have uh, some rose gold washi. We have, ooh, we have some A5 monthlies. Man, I wish one of these said nay, but we have a September one, which is in rose gold. And then we have a February one, which is in silver. We have a fall bucket list in rainbow hollow. We have a Halloween bucket list in rose gold. We have March and October, but no May, oh my goodness, we have March for the Erin Condren Monthly in the gold, and we have October in the gold. Again, it would be amazing if I had gotten a May in there, but no such luck. We have this foil, which goes with the November sub, which very specifically goes with whatever full boxes was in that. I don't know what that was, so I'm probably gonna de-stash that. We have, um, Hollow, a full box overlays, some uh, glitter header covers, and just some scripts. Uh, I guess this came with a kit. And then last but not least, we have some rose gold bougie boxes. And then finally, oh my goodness, this has been going on forever. I feel there's so much foil. We have these like big box overlays, and these are in rose gold. And then we have this sheet, which I'm not really sure what this is. Like what these cover, I'm not really sure what that's about. Um, but then we have some rainbow hollow icons and labels. And yeah, so that was in my huge foil grab bag. I literally have foil for days, years, forever, which is great. I don't know what I'm going to do with all this foil, but I'm sure I'll make use of it somehow, somewhere. So that is... All of the things I got on seal at Glam Planner. And then finally, last but not least, the very last thing I'm going to haul in this part of the haul video is the Glam Planner Spring Mystery of 2021. So if you guys don't want to see this, then you can move on to later in the video. But it's time to see what's inside. So naturally, I've already seen the foil at the back. And also the images at the front, so I can tell this is like an ice cream theme, which is super cute. And so yeah, uh, let's get into this. I got the Lux, and so this comes with a lot of extra boxes. So we have all of these. This one is a double box. It says gelato, please. And then we have the label add-on. And then we have some fashion girls and then the glitter headers, of course, cannot be without my glitter headers. So those are the add-ons. And then along with that, we also get this add-on, which is of the two different skin tones and then just like an ice cream tray, which is cute. Then moving on to the actual kit. Like I said, I got the Lux kit, so there's a lot here. So we have the full boxes the heart checklists, the alternative boxes. We have our heart checklists and our fancy labels. 
we have our deco we have our fancy labels and washi and headers and then we have some more blank headers and our icons and then the bottom washi and the date covers so that is the Glam Planner Spring Mystery 2021 and it is adorable and it just makes me think of the Blackpink song Ice Cream with Selena Gomez but I love it. This is so cute. This is so girly. This is so pink. This is so me and I love it so much. So that is the kit and then we got the foil as well so let's take a look at this. So this is the foil. It is dusty pink and so yeah, let's take a look. So we have the bottom washi overlay which is like a little ice cream which is cute. Then we have some fancy labels in the foil and then I guess our box overlays. I think this is the double box overlay so this like would match up with... Bear with me one second. So this is the foil that you would put over this and it would like you know go really well so that's cute and then we have these full box overlays so again these foil overlays match really well with these full boxes because that's how glam planner does it and i actually really like this kind of thing because it gives like a little bit more pizzazz to your full boxes if the foil matches exactly over these so yeah and then we just have some like script overlays as well so that is everything from glam planner and that brings us to the end of part one of this haul this haul is going to be so long and i can already feel it but like yeah so this is all of part one and i'm really happy with everything i'm really excited i gotta organize all of this and put it all away and then i will be back with you guys very soon for part two so Stay tuned. So my stackery order is not ready to be shipped because some shops are taking forever to dispatch, which is kind of annoying. But I did just really quick want to pop on to show you guys that I have a few orders from some UK stores that I wanted to show you. So we have two from Papershire and one from Happy Kitty Studio. So I think we'll start with Happy Kitty Studio first. So this is my Happy Cutie Studio order. I decided to order from them again because they were having a sale and that's the theme for this month. If someone was having a sale, I just could not resist. So I decided to pick up a few things from here. Okay, so first of all, we have our little freebie, which is cute. And then I have some No Cola Day stickers. We have some post office stickers because I've been going to the post office recently a lot because I've been selling some things online so I've been going to the post office a lot. We have some cute mortgage tracker stickers because your girl's an adult and we pay the mortgage now. We have some more filming tracker stickers. We have, oh, this one went rogue. We have some shopping bag stickers. We have some game console Switch stickers, which I want to use to track non-Animal Crossing Switch games because, believe it or not guys, I do own other games for my Switch and it's not just Animal Crossing and I really want to get back into playing like other Switch games. So I got these to track that and uh, we have some yoga mat stickers as well. So that is everything from Happy Cutie Studio. Nothing too wild or crazy. Most of these stickers I've ordered from them before and I just wanted to stock up on some and I think that's always good to do especially when there's a seal just so that you can save a little bit of money. Okay so next we have these two orders from Papershire and not gonna lie it was only meant to be one order from them but then literally hours after I had ordered the new releases dropped and there was a sticker sheet that I really wanted from them so I placed a second order literally hours after the first and here we are. So first of all we have 
two really cute journaling cards. I love the journaling cards from Paper Shire. They're so pretty. And if I was planning in a ring binder planner like the Aura Stelle, I would definitely be using these in my planner. But because I have an Erin Condren, there's nowhere for me to put these in my planner, unfortunately. But I still keep them because they're really pretty and I really adore them. So there's those. Then moving on to my actual orders. So we will go through the smaller order first. Okay, so literally, like I said, this is a really small order. It was just because there was new releases and there was like one sticker sheet that I really wanted. So first of all, we have the little freebie that comes with all the orders, which are these decorative boxes. And then these are the stickers that I got in the new releases. Of course, The Sims. Literally earlier in this video, I did say about how I needed some Sim stickers and then Paper Shire came out with the cutest Sim stickers. So obviously I wasted no time picking these up and I got two sheets of them because your girl is a very avid simmer. And then we just have our little journaling card. Again, super cute and adorable. So that is the first order. Moving on to our second order. All right, so first of all, I guess we'll just get this out of the way. Again, we have another one of these journaling cards. Super cute. There's nothing on the back of the Paper Shire journaling cards. And I feel like this is nice. Maybe like if you wanted to write something and just store it away for another day or something like that. But like, yeah, they're really cute. I love them. And then this is my actual order. So I decided that for this order, I would get the little like Facebook freebie. So basically, if you are a member of the Paper Shire Facebook group, you just need to put that in the comments of your order and then you will get a Facebook freebie exclusive. And so this was the one for April, which is super cute. Next, we just have the little all order freebie sheet. Again, the decorative boxes. Then we have some cute vanilla reading stickers because your girl can never have too many stickers to mark reading. We have some laundry ones, which are adorable. We have these Bun and Bear Valentine ones, which I thought would be really cute to mark when I hang out with my boyfriend. We have some vanilla blanket snuggle stickers, which are super cute. I love the vanilla stickers. Honestly, they're my favorite. We have some Stardew Valley stickers because your girl is also a big Stardew Valley player. Maybe not so much recently, but like I definitely love some Stardew Valley. I have Stardew Valley on the PC and also on the Switch and I really like it. Personally, I do play a lot more on the Switch, but I did start a new save recently on my PC because I really want them Steam achievements. So yeah, I definitely wanted some Stardew Valley stickers. And then we have these scrapbook flat lay stickers, which are gorgeous. I really want to get back into my scrapbooking, so I thought that getting some stickers might motivate me to do that. And then we are back to the beginning. So that is everything from Paper Shire. That is my little haul from some UK stores. Next time I talk to you guys, hopefully I will have my second stackery order because I'm getting really impatient waiting for it. And yeah. I will talk to you guys then. Okay, so I just finished editing this part of the haul and I realized that this video is going to get super long if I include part two. So what I'm gonna do is split the videos up so this will be part one and then you guys should hopefully see part two tomorrow. I think this is the best way to go, especially because some of the shops repeat in the second part of the haul anyway. So yeah, I'm just going to make two separate videos just so they're not super long. And so yeah. So I'm going to end this one here. I hope you guys enjoyed it. If you did, please give the video a thumbs up and subscribe for more. And let me know in the comments below what your favorite sticker shop is. Who do you always go to shop from? Because I really love to know. And obviously I'll be checking them out if I haven't shopped there before as well. And so yeah. Uh, like I said, I hope you guys enjoyed and I will see you in my next video. Bye guys.